Hi, everybody. My name is Nick Josh I teach virtual production and immersive media at Drexel University. And in this video, I'm going to show how you can use a Blackmagic ATEM Mini or a Blackmagic Deck Link board as a video source in Faceware Studio from version 1.5 or up. Now, currently, I have Faceware Studio running with a Magwell HDMI to USB. Now, the ATEM Mini is pretty easy. It's going to be available to us because it's a USB video source anyway. So if we go to our input type, we can select Blackmagic Design. This is the ATEM Mini that's connected to my computer. And now I have the ATEM Mini direct feed through USB as my video source in Faceware Studio. Now this did not work in versions prior to 1.5. This is a new feature of 1.5 and it now works. Uh, once I've got my video feed, I can just look at my camera and calibrate my neutral pose. And I'm tracking again. All right, the deck link board is a little bit different because it is not natively supported by Faceware Studio. So if I were to go to my input type here and I select deck link video capture, I'm going to get an error and I won't have any video source anymore. Not to worry, because one of the other new features of Faceware 1.5 is the ability to receive a OBS virtual camera input. Now I don't have my virtual camera input running, so I get this blank screen. OBS, of course, is open broadcast software. It's a free download. A link will be in the description. And so I have that running in the background, and I'll go over to that now. And now I need to add the deck link board as a video source. So down here in OBS sources, I'll go ahead and click the plus button and choose a video capture device. I'll give it a name. I'll just call it deck link. And with that added, I'll make sure I'm selecting my Blackmagic WDM capture, and we're all set. So I'll say OK. Now, the camera is streaming in Ultra HD, and my output for OBS is currently set to HD, which is actually just fine. What I can do is scale this down so we get a full HD video feed, and I can fill that frame with my face. And this is really ideal for tracking. Full Ultra HD doesn't actually add a whole lot of fidelity to the tracking mechanism itself. So just by filling this frame, I suppose it would be better if I had my camera turned sideways and filled my frame vertically in uh, portrait mode. But for this demo, this will work. So this is now the video signal that's in Open Broadcast Software, OBS. And all I need to do to feed it over to Faceware is activate Start Virtual Camera. Clicking this. Now this is being streamed as a virtual camera. And of course, it's showing up in Faceware Studio. Again, I can just look at my camera and calibrate neutral pose. And I'm tracking again, this time through my Blackmagic Decklink board via OBS. Hope this helps. Until next time, have fun.